Hello, welcome viewers to Elim TV where we are, whereby we learn and experience. We are going to have our first uh, lesson which is uh, biology. Whereby the topic we are going to have it is introduction to biology. And the subtopic is uh, we are going to learn what is biology. Your tutor will be Mr. Gerard. Welcome. Before we start, we have our lesson goals whereby which should be achieved by the end of the lessons. You should be able to state meaning of biology, you give its significance, and also you state three branches of biology. We, are, we, are, we have learned that biology is the study of living things, and we have got several uh, branches of biology. Whereby the first branch is botany, this is study of plants. We have two, zoology, whereby zoology is the study of animals. We also have a, another branch of biology, which is Genetics. Genetics is the study of inheritance and variation. We also love uh, cytology. Whereby cytology is the study of cells. We still have also virology. Whereby virology is the study of cells. Uh, uh, virus, sorry. We also have entomology. Whereby entomology is the study of insects. We also have bacteriology. Whereby bacteriology is the study of bacteria. We are going to have a diagrammatic representation of the branches of biology, whereby the first uh, diagram represents an animal, whereby we said uh, an animal, uh, it is a zoology. The second one, we have bacteriology being represented by bacteria. The third one is a branch known as insecta, whereby uh, in our diagram is being represented by insects. The fourth one is a virus, whereby we said the study of virus is virology we also have plant whereby you have said the study of plant is plant time we have some several importances of biology which include one <coughs> one is able to understand developmental stages in the body it is also a career subject whereby one can become uh, for example a, a teacher even one can become a doctor with the uh, knowledge in biology it also imparts scientific uh, it also involves scientific skills such as observation, identifying, drawing, recording, measuring, classifying, and also analyzing and evaluation of data. Uh, biology is also used to solve environmental problems uh, such as food shortage, pollution, drought, and etc. We have characteristics of living things. Remember we have said that biology is a study of living things we have got several uh, characteristics of those living things which include one we have got uh, uh, nutrition whereby nutrition is a process by which organisms acquire and utilize nutrients we also have a second characteristics of living things which include excretion whereby excretion is the process by which waste or harmful materials resulting from metabolic reactions within cells of organisms are eliminated from the body we also have another characteristic which is reproduction, whereby reproduction is a process by which living things give rise to new individuals of the same kind. We also have uh, what is known as growth and development. Uh, we are going to define each, whereby uh, growth is an irreversible increase in size and mass, while development refers to the irreversible change in the complexity of an organism. Having done that, we are going to have some several activities whereby you will be, um, I like you to define the term biology. You also have to state four reasons why biology should be, uh, should be studied. Uh, for further information or reference, you can go to your KLB, uh, Secondary Biology Students Book 1, 4th Edition Biology, which is uh, verified by the Kenya Literature Bureau. Uh, for more information, uh, you can contact us through an SMS we are using, uh, you, you send an SMS to the number 22518. You can also reach us through our Facebook page, uh, which is Elimu TV, or you tweet us at, at Elimu, uh, Elimu TV underscore Kenya. Thank you and welcome much.